Occupied. Hey, asshole, it's taken. Oh, what the fuck? No, 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 what are you doing? Ah, ah, ah. Fifth member of the Hidden Family Mafia killed in the last three months. Looks like someone's waging war. Looks like it. Well, at least someone's getting rid of those assholes. Apparently the Mafia is below Enderboy's pay grade. The kid catches petty arm dealers and thieves. He's below our pay grade. Still, whoever those guys are, they're taking out the biggest Mafia in New York. Maybe finding them can wait for a bit. Who knows? Maybe they can rape out each other and then we can have true peace. Nothing is ever peaceful, Jacob. Plus, Mafia or no Mafia, they're people still. Gotta do our jobs. Uh, I'm sorry I'm here. I I'm sorry. I, I got it, sir. I got it. Hey. I love this place. I find it extremely infuriating. Come on, you gotta socialize sometime. You're a pretty charismatic guy. How do you think you swept me off my feet? You asked me out, not the other way around. When he comes. <clears throat> when he comes. <clears throat> Oh no. I'm not I'm not doing this creepy dippy stuff. Where's your boss? What? I know you weren't a part of what happened. I won't hurt you if you just tell me where your boss is. Listen, Michael Myers, you're in the middle of a neighborhood. You hurt me and people will hear me scream. They'll come outside and they'll see you standing there looking like a creepy marshmallow. You really think I have much care? I will kill you right here where you stand. Pick it up. Hello? It's... It, it, it's... it's for you. Austin Warper, how are you? Who is this? A friend. Just looking to help you out. How did you know I was here? Oh. I know where you are at all times. Come by the old Starlight Productions building in Manhattan. I'll meet you on the roof. Also, Warper, he doesn't know who you're looking for. Let him go. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Why is this place empty? Took the liberty to close the place till we're gone. You must got something good then. Potential subject in the lick case. The lick case. Yeah, 
That's what I named the new secret organization. The L on the wall and the fact that they cut the dude's tongue out, the name sort of fits now. Alright, so what you got on Lick LLC? <laughs> Funny, LLC. Well, we know one thing for certain. They want to get caught. They want people to find out who they are. Gee, I wonder what gave that away. Was it the killings or the fact that they leave an L everywhere they kill? That's not all, Jackson. There's also a pattern. Every killing is a step higher in the hidden family's ranks. If we can figure out who's above this guy... We can figure guy, out where the lick are going next. Exactly. And we'll be one step higher to figuring out who runs the hidden family. So win-win. I think I have a CI that can help. It's not going to be easy, so give me some time. You got it. Hey Jackson, let's get both of those sons of bitches. Alright, you can open this place now. I'm hungry. You like that? Who the hell are you? How do you know my name? Well, I'm sure you have a lot of questions, Austin. Trust me, I have questions for you too. But a knife isn't going to get me to help you. That's better. Now to answer your first question, I'm Georgina. Now it's my turn to ask. I'm not playing these games. It's not a game. It's getting to know each other. So, why do you always wear that mask? Looks like a bleached Enderboy mask. I do admit it is kind of creepy. How do you know me? This is going to be a one-sided interview. Well, I guess you are more scary, so I'll play by your rules. I've been studying you for a while. After the incident, you turned into a monster. Alright, so next question. Who's the leader of the Hidden Family? That... I have no idea. But I know the guy you're looking for. The Gunman. Sorry, sorry. I had a lot of work to do. Right. So Joshua and the boys are work now. You called? You know, if you weren't gonna take this relationship seriously, you didn't have to say yes. Listen, I'm sorry, okay? I'm sorry. It's just been a long day at work. I needed to release some stress. Fine, but next- Who was it? Jeez, that was a huge switch in emotions. Come on, let's go. Hey, how did you know where I was? I paid a homeless guy to put a tracker in your clothes. No, no, no! Fuck, fuck, fuck! Jackson, what is it? That was my fucking CI! It's like... It's like they're one step ahead of us every time. Then we just gotta stay three steps ahead. And how's that? Every time we try to get ahead, we come to another bloody scene. Jackson, they fucked up this time. His contact books are still there. Lick didn't take them. So, like, do you sleep with the mask on? My bad. When is this guy showing up? He usually takes a hooker to that hotel across the street every week. I think his wife and kids know, but they're too scared to confront him about it. You know way too much about these people's lives. Yeah, well, you usually get more information when you aren't killing the people you look into. That's him. Whoa, whoa! You can't go in there wearing a mask, that's weird. Here, have my hoodie. Oh yeah, baby. Ah! Out. Listen, if, if this is about the money, I, I told him I'd get it next week. I'm going to ask you once and only once, what is your connection to the Hidden Family? What? What the fuck is that? Don't fuck me about it. I know you're the gunman. I can't even shoot a water gun. Why would it be the gunman? Bullshit. 
I don't know what you're talking about. Quit bullshitting me. Listen, I don't know anything about the hidden Bullshit. family. I've never even heard of them. I swear I thought he was the guy. You swear? Oh, you swear. You almost made me kill an innocent man. No, no, this can't be right. Can't be right? This is all about being right or wrong. I may have done some fucked up things, but at least I never got the wrong person. You don't think I know that? You don't. My husband died to people like this. The Hidden Family killed him, and every day I felt this lingering pain in my chest. He's gone, and I'm never gonna see him again. So yes, Austin. I do know the stakes, so don't you dare tell me I don't. You're not the only one who's lost someone close to you because of this shit. But the difference between me and you is I still have a smile on my face when I get out of bed every morning because I feel like there's still hope. I may not be Ender Boy or whatever, but that's not going to stop me doing it the right way. And my way isn't right. You said it yourself. You've done some fucked up things. But at least I'm bringing justice. At least I'm keeping these scum off the streets. I'm done having this conversation. Find the real gunman, or fuck off. Hey boss. I think I know who's killing our people. So you're working with Lick? Huh? Jackson Ryan of the NYPD. We got you, you son of a bitch. Uh, Jackson... Why did we bring him here? I just gotta ask him some stuff. This isn't protocol, Jackson. Fuck the protocol! Sometimes you gotta get your hands dirty. How many people do you have? Is that all you got, you pussy? How many people Jackson, do you have? Jackson, I don't have? think we should- It's just me. You killed all those people? Seventy people. By yourself? Seventy? I thought it was twenty. Twenty are just the ones you should know. Jackson? How do you know it's 70? Why? Not a flinch? I'm gonna kill you. All of you! <laughs> I can kill you right here, right now, but you know what? You could be useful to me. How about we bury the hatchet? I don't kill you, you can get to work for me. Reconsider? Or do you want to carry on making stupid decisions? You want to know what makes me so successful? I don't take people's shit. And I won't take yours. Where... Where are you... There? Lick, I don't even know who you are, really. There he is! Austin! You okay? What... what happened? The cop... he's... he's the guy. We thought it was more, but it was one man, killing us. He had the advantage. We didn't know who he was, 
And yeah, we only know about the mask. But now the damage is in our corner. Why do you always choose to talk on rooftops? I like the fresh air. No distractions. How are you feeling? I'm fine. You just got your ass kicked. You're not fine. Come on, the guys have a medical staff. I said I'm fine. Also, where the hell did you get the mini-military to save me? Let's just say the Hidden Family has a lot of enemies, and I have a lot of money to spend. We have to stop him. Thought you weren't the hero type. He's gonna come after me. And you. Thought you didn't care? I don't. Wait! I can still help you. No. Why are you so scared to get help? That doesn't concern you. I told you about my husband. I know you lost someone, but I don't know who it was. Please, just give me some insight. My whole life, I've only ever loved one person. My family kicked me out when I was young because I was different, because I didn't hold the values they did. All I want now is for the hidden family to fall. I know the chances of me surviving alone are slim, but I can't have someone's innocent blood in my hands. Still doesn't explain the mask. Lick. This must really hurt you. Usually we kill the witnesses, but not tonight. You're gonna pay off your little boyfriend's debt. Or you'll kill yourself from watching your love die. Shit, you might even go to the police. You'll definitely kill yourself if you do that. Hey! HEY! LOOK AT ME WHEN I TALK TO YOU! I remember you now. We're not that different. We kill because we do what we need to do. I wear my mask to keep my life clean. Why do you? I think that's where the difference lies. You hide your face because you're ashamed of who you are. Of the things you've done. <sighs> I ain't ashamed of a damn thing. You should be. You've cost me a lot of money. Your life can cost me my normal life. That's what you are. A cost. I can blow your head away. I can end you right now. But where's the fun in that? Austin? Austin! Oh, come on, Austin. Can you stop being Princess Peach for one goddamn day? Is that all you got? One tough son of a bitch. I can do this all day, asshole. Bring me Jesse. So you are the man who killed Alexander. No. He isn't. I am. I brought him in here to show you your mistake. How you ended up here. How the spiral ended for you. I have eyes and ears everywhere. Right now, I'm just fucking with you. Having my fun. Because of the damage you've caused me in my organization. You're fucked, Lick. There's two ways this goes. I kill you and wreak the awards as a cop, or I turn you in and frame you for killing my partner, and I still wreak the awards. You killed him. Did I? I have eyes and ears everywhere, but those eyes and ears see and they hear what I say. What the fuck? Go check it out.
A beard? It suits you. Eh, the mask looks better. Here. Let's kill this bastard. This doesn't feel right. Austin! Alright, I'm, I'm done, done playing, playing games. What did I just do? Please. Austin, no, you can't do this! You can be better! That mask doesn't have to represent pain! It can be so much more! There's no going back. Hey. His name was Alexander. Alexander Creed. He was my boyfriend. Jackson killed him because of some debts. I don't wear the mask because I'm ashamed of what I do. I wear it because I know he can see me, and I know he's disappointed in the things I've done. You might want to step away a bit. Your mask is going to be in your warehouse. Give it new meaning, Austin. Make him proud. Nenda boy mask. Nice. Walk away. I don't want to hurt you. Ah, walking away isn't really what I do. Besides, I've heard you've been caught in trouble, and the NYPD aren't really impressed. Listen, I, I got some weird stuff going on in the city recently, and I, it'd just be easier for me if you just turn yourself in, and we could get on with the rest of our lives. Uh, I guess that's a no. I don't want to hurt anybody anymore. I just want a new life. I hope you can understand. Yeah. And I could do with some new ribs.